gratitude to you, Executor. Jepok will continue to stand as a beacon of light for the Templar, thanks to you and your comrades' bravery in the face of encroaching darkness. Enthusiasm is very touching, and we are all extremely pleased to know you are among us once again, Nanoth, Tyradun. But I'm afraid the Executor's business is far from finished. If what our scouts tell us is fact, then there will be more than an upcoming darkness to keep us all on our guard. Executor, one of our long-range reconnaissance parties has detected a massive cluster of Zerg forces to the west. Scouts reported a weakening of shield energies commensurate with increasing physical proximity to the cluster's heart. The few observers that reached the heart before losing power relayed images of a large cocoon in the center of the hive. We believe this cocoon itself to be the source of the psionic drain. Now, if memory serves, the Terrans dabbled extensively, though crudely, in the harnessing of psychic energies. Before being called back to defend Aya from invasion, our fleets detected a small Terran outpost on the surface of Char, emitting strong psionic carrier waves. And why has the Conclave ignored this settlement? At the time, other concerns pressed us. Now, however, that outpost may hold the key to countering whatever power the Zerg have been gaining over our forces. Executor, you will lead an expedition to the surface of Char to pinpoint the location of the Terran settlement. I will be joining you on this mission to oversee your progress. With any luck, we may find some of the answers to this mystery. Korun and Ulrak will stay with us at the temple to guard it from further attacks. Hold strength, Executor, and may a doom watch over you. You think as I do? 
You think as I do. Make use of my law to become a master. Go, Gora. Thus I serve and transmit. What is it now? Some Kalados? It's okay. Receive it.
Fire. Looks like we've got company of a different sort for a change. Identify yourself, human. Name's Mox, Charlie Mox, commander of the Char Star Reserve. And you would be. Judicator Sam Alice of the Protoss High Command. We seek to identify the source of the psychic carrier waves emanating from these coordinates. Well, if our ESP bores aren't the source of it, you must be talking about the old underground Morian mining and research facility to the southeast. Not much more than a stone's throw from here. I assume the source of the psionic emanations may be found in the installation itself. Oh, sure. The only reason we haven't checked it out is a swarm of Zerg keeping the airlock company. A whole lot of the buggers got the place packed in tighter than a Joey in a Wallaby's pouch. But, uh, if you ever got your hands on whatever it is that's causing those waves, sure our scientists could take a look at it. Very well, but will require heavy escorts. Right, well, Gurney here's my second in command. This squad's been through a lot, but he's the best there is. Ain't that right, Gurney? Oh, there's plenty of gear. No worries. So, uh, you up for it, mate? Agreed. We will hold position here until your forces are ready. Yes? Yes, I see. I see you have constructed this outpost around the remains of an inactive volcano. Yeah, Mount Midnight, we like to call it. We're tapping the core, using it as a geothermal power source. It makes a great hobby for our scientists, too.
Research complete. Research complete. I'm listening. You want a piece? 
piece of me, boy. I read you. Goliath online. Sounds about right. Standing by. 
Let's move. Go, go, go. Outstanding. Rock and roll. Yeah, go ahead. Give me something to shoot. Go, go, go. Rock and roll. Outstanding. Let's move. Mark's here. What's the plan? All right, let's move. Jacked up and good to go. Go, go, go. Let's move. Standing by. What's the story? Commander. Outstanding. Rock and roll. Outstanding. Go, go, go. Let's move. Rock and roll. Got a smoke, mate? Now that's a bonzer idea. Give me something to shoot. Outstanding. Let's move. Rock and roll. Mark's here. What's the plan? 